mission is hard, and doing what God has told us to do is not easy, but very rewarding. that there's a command here and that Jesus Christ has something very specific that he wants Philip to do. Now, if you remember from earlier on in Acts, we hear a very similar command to, from, from Christ to Paul, don't we? Saul, don't we? Christ comes to Saul and he, he says, arise. And then he says, go. And now we have Philip and Jesus Christ appears to him and he says, arise. And go. Open my hands, humble my heart. All that I have is yours. Color my prayers, widen my eyes, wash me in glorious light. Oh, the joy to be, joy to know. Now, again, I want to address, for those of you who have questions about the Bible, I want to ask you a very important question. Here's a, here's a question for you. If you're interested in learning more about Jesus in the Bible, are you, are you willing to take the time to study it? Are you willing to commit? Are you willing to ask someone to sit down with you and explain it? And are you willing, here's the deal, here's the biggest thing. When the Bible gives you answers that are sufficient for your questions, are you willing to believe and submit to it? Like, are you willing to say yes? Like, again, dis despite your, your presumptions or, or your thoughts, or, or despite the fact that it doesn't, it doesn't sound easy, are you willing to obey the scripture when the Bible is opened and someone teaches you? <laughs> 